<laughs> We've enjoyed the Rugby League poetry of Rupert McCall, Rupert McCall and as a true Queenslander, he couldn't let the victory in the game one fade from our memories. So from Rupert's lounge room, we relive another Queensland miracle. It was going to be the biggest 80 minutes of their life. Those who said it wouldn't work were sharpening the knife. And we were asking questions over beers before the game. We wondered whether Origin would ever be the same. But in the silence of a tunnel, in the air of what would happen, we heard the cry of Queensland. And now our hearts were clapping. Uncertainty was in the past. We knew the stuff to come. Smash and bash and take it up. Then let the leather hum. It was go, you bloody Queenslander. Offload that magic pass. Grab that dirty cockroach and kick his cocky ass. With Alan, Bartram, Hearn and Hone to even up the scores. Then Larson, Gilly, Shearer, Lamb and both the Queensland Moors. Teev and Coyne and Iken too, with Dallas on the wing. Oh, Davis Cook, and don't forget the hold-up merchant sing. And six to one for Queensland, well, I had to have a punt. And so my voice was more than fired when the boys were two in front. Could a fairy tale be written with a Queensland rooster crow? We're on our knees and praying when the clock said one to go. It was going to be the biggest 60 seconds of their life. Those who said it wouldn't work had put away the knife. Come on, boys, you're almost there as Wishart found some space. But pretty soon he found the state of Queensland in his face. Into touch you go, old son, we'll take the feed. A set of six, a grubber kick, and that is all we'll need. Come on, Eddie, blow it, mate. Just take the thing and blow it. The whistle hit his lips. And on my lounge room, you would know it. Get that up, you New South Wales, I heard my mother shout. Tunners came the shoulder charge and almost knocked me out. But still I sculled my beer and then I cracked another one. Magpoy raised a fist and screamed, good on you, fatty son. Heels and steely air punch like they'd won the FA Cup. To sum it up as easy, we were pretty fired up. There's a moral to this story, a heap of the fact. Never stay the game as lost before the scrum is packed. Never doubt a Queenslander, never miss your shout. Never ride his colour off and never back him out. And don't be fooled to think that he has given up the ghost, for that is when he'll grow ten foot and make you hurt the most. And when the game has won, there's something else that's fairly clear. Don't forget how sweet it is to taste that Queensland beer. Queensland! Queensland.